Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of MechWarrior 5 Modded. So today we need to finish our multi-mission. Uh, and then... I think after we do that, we gotta go repair all of our other mechs. And then we've got, looks like, at least four more mechs that we can build here. And we will probably get some more salvage from this mission. So, let's find our lineup. Who are we gonna use? Uh... That's a good question. Thinking I might go with the Griffin again. Uh, for you, probably Centurion. What's your uh, your energy? No, let's go Hunchback for you. Oh, I actually meant the other Hunchback. Uh, this guy is our Ballistic Specialist. He's really good with Phoenix Hawk, though. Um, hmm, I guess the Centurion, and then this guy is Energy and Missile, so maybe the Shadow Hawk, huh? Uh, we could go Shadow Hawk, or, no, I like that, let's just do the Shadow Hawk, that's fine. All right. So, I really do wonder if this is going to be as hard as the last mission was. I guess we're going to find out. Because, man, for a raid, that was tough. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Hey, Commander, welcome to the planet. Um... There's a patrol that we need you to go on. If you could just yeah, go okay. to the nav point. Seems and, straightforward. Um, you know, if you, if you find anybody hostile, just, you know, take care of it. How come you're not and, showing uh, me you your back, face, um, buddy? It would be great if, uh, could I have your autograph? Yeah, this seems a little suspicious. Are they ambushing us? It's a trap. All right, well, I guess we'll find out once we get a little closer. Man, I still need to reinstall that cockpit glass Don't mod and see if that blow. works okay. Surprised it hasn't been updated yet for the DLC. Uh, it just makes the raindrops appear a lot better on the uh, cockpit. Because we're not... Oh, what is this? Existing enemy force. Okay. It's not... Not necessarily an ambush. Okay, that was one of three. So somewhere around here, there are two more. There they are. Uh, that one is an Irby, so we're gonna go for the Locust first. Yep, piece of cake. Yeah, I have to say this, Griffin is actually quite strong. It's just short range is the only thing. He's not super fast by any means. So, and a little warm, if I'm being honest. The heat could be uh, mitigated a little better. But you take what you can get, right? Okay, let's see what's going on here. Sorry, did I put a big footprint in your wall? Nope, it's fine. Okay. to evac. So that was it. We just had to clear the enemies that were here. I guess. Oh, man. We're not going to have much salvage from this, are we? Dang. I should have taken more money instead of salvage points. Uh, yeah, that kind of sucks. We had, what, a Locust, an Irby? What was the first one? I don't know, but it was something small. It went down really quick. So, Commander, that kind of sucks. Nope, the there we go. More enemies. Ambushing us. Okay. Good. Oh, man, I was going to be really disappointed if that was all we had for salvage opportunity. So, let's see what's dropping here. Hopefully some heavier stuff. 
Yeah, okay, I see an archer. Hunchback. What else is there? Super Griffin. And a catapult. Okay. Sure. That's not bad. Uh, they do need to get closer to us, though, and they're not. Uh... Okay, can I get over the wall, please? There we go. Uh, can you guys stay safe, please? We're on the move. Stay inside the base. New target, Hunchback. At the assigned location. Yeah, our Centurion there is taking a lot of damage. Can you get out of the way, please? We'll go. Focusing fire. Okay, now Copy get in the that. base. Let's move. Target destroyed. Oh man, what is he doing? Dude's taking way too much damage. Uh, I want you guys to get to a really safe spot, like it. over there. Okay, and then uh, Hunchback Oscar, on me. Shadowhawk, Shadowhawk on me as well. Uh, actually, let's put you guys like right here, so you're close by but still protected. Holding at location. Okay, we need somebody to come at us. And there he is. Asking ye shall receive. Is he gonna keep coming? Yes, he is. Down for the camp. Okay, uh, punch back. Get your butt over there. I'm not sure why he was in the doorway there. Oh, they blew open the doorway. Okay. I don't think I can reach. And the archer is right there. Okay. Um. Yeah, we kind of need to go for that catapult, don't we? These guys are going to be exposed, though. Let's see. Put you guys over here. Okay. Now, let's make a little window. Yeah, we need to just go for the catapult, I think. Holding at that point. Okay, you guys on me. We gotta go for it. Just range on those small blazers. I guess they'll reach now. Go. Just the archer now. Yeah, he'll be he'll go down pretty quick here. There we go. You gonna leave any salvage for later? Hopefully. Uh. Okay. Everybody on me. Okay. Well, I don't like that the centurion took so much damage, but he didn't lose anything, so that's definitely a plus. Let's see if we can get out of here without any more mishaps. I think it's going to be okay. Usually at this point, I don't think you get any more enemies spawning in. So we should be alright. So, I do like this Griffin build. Uh, you know, it's close range. That's really the only downside to it. With the small blazers, they're pretty strong, honestly. Uh, I'm happy with, with the damage that they do. And then, of course, the SRM-12 is an Lots excellent finisher. Lots of places to hide. Oh, right. window for extraction is closing. Okay, yep. We're Let's out of here. here. Alright. Let's see what we can pull from that. It's still only seven mechs uh, for salvage possibility. Uh, we were... We were doing a lot of damage to the cores, so I wouldn't be surprised if uh, a couple of those mechs are not in the loot table. <coughs> Let's see. Two point five mil. Okay, archer catapult. We we can take catapult parts. That's good. Uh, Super Griffin was designed in 3020 as a part of Project Phoenix, together with the Super Wasp at the 
fried in an aerospace park research facility on Hoff by house Davian scientists, including Dr. Jorge Velasco. After 18 months of work, an operational Super Griffin prototype had been completed, but it was still untested when the Black Widow Company attacked the facility on May 13th, 3022. The Super Griffin was a test bed for prototype improved jump jets and prototype double heatsink kits or, or double heatsinks developed by the NAIS after reviewing the Halstead collection. So it's got one ballistic, three energy, and two missile hard points. Uh, interesting. Prototype jump jets and prototype heat sink. Prototype improved jump jets, I should say. Uh, the prototype heat sink kit is interesting. What are the chances it would give us that as part of our salvage? Or um, when we put it together. Not salvage, but you know what I mean. We could take these Protos heat sinks though. We could take the LRM15 stream. Some improved prototype improved jump jet class threes. We'll definitely take those. Mm. No, I don't want that Herbie. Uh, more tier four small blazers. Nice. We can uh, upgrade what we got. Kind of like that as well. So, we're going to have to drop a catapult part, looks like. Uh, so, we do need seven more. Or, we have seven more points that we need to spend on something. Uh, Super Griffin was nine as well. Okay. Well... I guess we'll... No, I don't want a hunchback part. I guess we're going to take... That. And... We'll take that. Take a couple of those. And we'll take that. And a single heat sink, I guess. Okay. 600, 1, 3, and 1 bruised but he has no capacity for negative quirks which is awesome so yeah he took a lot of damage there uh not too much to fix it up though so i think we're gonna be okay there that's good that is very good all right what do we got in cantina collect two fire starter mechs do we have fire starters i feel like we have at least one. Oh yeah we got a bunch of those oh so i need to do one of those um I don't really want to drop any of these. That is unfortunate. It's just that aerospace fighter capture. And so tier or difficulty 60, so we're definitely not gonna do that. Alright, we gotta drop something. So what do we drop? The flea? I mean we are gonna get that flea eventually. Hmm. Let's get rid of that one. I guess, well, do I really want to do that? Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Okay. Collect two fire starters, I will accept. Okay, and let's, do I have to take them out? No, I don't, okay. So we get medium laser short burst. Again, basically just medium lasers. Uh, and then some heat sinks. Okay. I think we're definitely going to give him this one. Looks like this one. Although, yeah, whatever. It don't matter. Okay. Good enough for me. Damage tuning. Yeah, ballistics, right? Uh, okay. And then maybe we'll take that one. Although we're not going into an area that low level, are we? That's this area. Yeah, we're not going there. So no. I guess I'll take this one for now. We could probably switch that out later. 
Uh, yeah, let's just go to the industrial hub now. So we can fix everything up. All right. So we are going to build some mechs here. We got salvage to put together. Uh, we got are also going to repair all. Uh, I do need to switch out that tier three laser though. Small blazer tier four. Throw that guy on there. And repair all, start work, Q. Good. Uh, let's see. Could we just do a repair all for everything else? I think so. A large laser on the trebuchet. And that's it. Okay, so repair all. Let's make sure that was replaced. Yep, very nice. Okay, so now we go to our salvage assembly. Yeah, let's go ahead and sell or assemble all of these. So we got that one, we got that one, we got that one, and we got the Irby. Irby. Okay, now then, what did we get from these? Nothing. A couple lasers. Laser, SRM, jump jet, and jump jets. Hmm. Okay. Uh, so yeah, I think maybe we just put all these in storage, huh? Well, definitely the Irby. Uh, Trebuchet 5S. What was the one that we already had? 5N. So what's the difference? Basically the same. Versatile. Weapon lock on timer. Weapon equipment refit time. Equipment refit cost. Optimal range for all weapons. And max range for all weapons. Interesting. So what does this one have that it doesn't? So they both have easy to maintain, fast reload, free world sleek. This one has missile platform. And this one just has versatile. Um... Yeah, we don't need more medium mechs. I think we're good on that. So let's just put all these up. The Enforcer. I do kind of like Enforcers. They're a decent mech. Um, I don't think I really see a use for it, though. So we're going to put that up as well. Uh, if there's a certain mech that you guys want to see me build that we haven't built yet... Let me know. I'm not opposed to building really any of these, you know? Um, yeah, we don't have a lot that's great here. But, like, for example, let's say somebody really likes the Enforcer. You want to see me build one and play it. Let me know in the comments. I'll, uh, I'll build one out and test it. Uh, let's go ahead. Man. So we're really close on a lot of these. Um... Yeah, too bad. Now, let me check the shop real quick. Hey, that's the last one we need, right? Sweet. Uh, anything else worth taking? I'm not going to do sniper cannons. Heat bank mark one. Let's take those. They're cheap. Probably won't ever use them because I think it's better just to use heat sinks generally. Um... But you never know, right? Uh, is there any ammo that we need? Probably. Uh, Flak AC-5. Incendiary AC-10 double. Sure. AC-20 double. Sure. Uh, just one of those is probably fine. Yeah, I think that's it. Okay, uh, last, let's check the, the barracks real let's quick. Shielding one, evasiveness three. 
I don't really want to wait 170 days here. Consider it done. Mm. This is Adder. Yeah, you don't need any of those. Locked and loaded, boss. Just give the order. I wouldn't really know with you. Heat and shielding, heat and missile. Yeah, it's shielding and invasiveness. So that's I'm not going to happen. Nope. We probably really should upgrade some more of these guys. Um. This is snowshoe. I could do evasiveness three on snowshoe. It's not. It's not awful. We can upgrade it to a five later. Really need to get some offensive. Stats on him though. Let's just do that and then for you. Uh who do we want to do another point on? I, I just need to keep well no, I I actually need four pilots. So yeah, I just need to keep four of these pilots available. Glad to be Six, five, five. So they all have five quirk slots. Except for uh, Adder, which has six. Glad to join the company, Commander. Let's kick some ass. I guess we'll just do Goblin, huh? We're not using him right now, so that's fine. We won't really have to switch up our lineup. Okay. Uh, should we check out the arena jobs here real quick? Oh, yeah, and we gotta do this. Uh, six Artemis Dream. Tier three. That's decent. Okay, shorter burn time or something like that. Uh, free for all, two mission op, medium free for all. We could do that. We could do both of these. A duel against a medium mech. Well, that should be super easy. Let's do that first. Okay, what are we going to use? Uh, we got to remove everybody first. Okay, and then we're going to switch pilots, but I want to use the pilots good with the mech that I'm going to actually take. So do we take the griffin, or do we take the hunchback? Or the shadowhawk? <clears throat> Which one do we feel like is probably the best option for arena duel? The hunchback is a really good option, uh, but I think we're going to have to go with the griffin. So let's stick with griffin. How long does he have... We will know in just a second. Uh, nobody's really good with the griffin yet, huh? Okay, so we are gonna go with Grid's Adder. So far, Commander. Nine days? Yeah, that's not a problem. Alright, we're ready to roll. I said, let's roll. Yep. The match is underway, and you can feel the intensity in the <laughs> air. He's in Hopefully a Griffin, too. He's got LRM-10 and PPC. That's not going to do Jackson. a whole lot. Yes, I mean, the PPC, turn of sure, maybe. Uh, I am really not worried about it, though. Incoming missile. Yeah, he's gonna go down quick. Wow, he's Piece of cake. On his show. They're gonna have to renovate this place when he's done. Cause he's bringing the house down. He's so cake. Wins the day. Barely even he touched me. Well, once we got close talks. to him, he can't fire the LRMs at us. And the PPC, the I don't think the, the AI pilots like to fire graveyard. PPCs at close range Just because you're inside that disruption ghost. field. Um, and I feel like the AI pilots try to avoid that, so he probably wasn't really trying to shoot me with the PPC too much. But, uh, yeah. I think he did get one shot off with it, though. Okay. Veteran. So we're at, uh, level 9 now. Arena fame. We have almost made it to arena level 2. So we will get that far on the next one, I guess. Um, yeah, what else are we going to take, huh? Well, that was dumb. 
for a duel, I should have been thinking one mech. Although, honestly, I thought it would give us more parts than that. I guess I should have gone for the headshot. Um, but yeah, I definitely should have, could have taken more money there. Hazing of the week. Okay. Let's go ahead and repair. How much damage was it? 1.74 damage. <laughs> oh, that's nothing. Okay, let's do this. Uh, free for all, right? So just one mech. That's eh, fine. We'll have lots more options for salvage this time. Yeah, I'll stick with the Griffin. He's fun. <clears throat> It's a good arena mech, I think. He could be a little faster, of course. Um, if we ever get to the point where we're still using this and we get XL engines, which is highly unlikely that we're still going to be using this mech at that point. But you could always drop an XL engine in it and bump up his speed. Then it would really be good. Maybe some double heat sinks too. A double heat sink kit would go a long ways. Our assigned mech target is on the field. You don't let's say. Take it down. Well, let's yeah, let's get him. Oh, and we're right. off to the races. These mech warriors are about to trade laser uh, and cannon let's blasts. Let's go yeah, this way first, I think. Yeah, that does not sound very tasty, Jackson. Yeah, it probably isn't. Bam! The first shot has landed. Here we go, Cotton. Okay, we got to deal 400 damage to feasting. entertain the crowd. Yeah, there they are. I don't know. I could go that way first. Nah, this guy up here is closer, I think. Phoenix Hawk. He's fresh, though. Nobody else around for him to pick on. I think he's coming for me as well. Holy crap, Cotton. We're both headed for each other. There he is. Now things really kicked off in here. Oh, he is shooting at somebody. Maybe uh, they'll fire back. His arm just pulled a disappearing act. It was magical. It got blown uh, off somewhere in the arena. Now you see it. Now wait, where'd they go? Oh, right there. Cicada, no, that's not who he's fighting. Who is he shooting at? Weird. Well, now he's shooting at me. So now you get to die. Ammo case just erupted. I swear it wasn't me! I said ammo. Oh, phew. Cotton, there's another okay, opponent Cicada. down for the count. Also so fresh. Overrated, Jackson. Come on, buddy, where are you going? Quit running around away. Let's go. Okay, getting a little hot here. Oh, that was close to a shutdown. All right, let's head over here. We can get these guys. Yeah, they're having fun tearing each other apart. Yeah, Griffin in there, too. If we get a shot in the back, we can get him. Did you see that? if he keeps this up, get rid of his weapons. Now they're both pretty much disarmed. Another opponent bites the dust. Oh no, a small laser. Whatever will I do? Another opponent down with authority. He made it look easy. Okay, what do we got left? Griffin and a crab. Crab, we just gotta shoot in the back. Griffin, we could take the legs off. Piece of cake. Jump jet fuel low. Jump jet fuel empty. Okay, how are they doing? Target acquired. Oh yeah, Crab is about to go down. Unless he takes out the Griffin's legs. Jump jet fuel low. Jump jet fuel empty. Yeah, they're still going at it. New target, Crab. God, and this could be a tipping point right here. His leg just got blown right off. He will definitely tip over if he loses there another leg, Jackson. Out of range. Cotton, he stacked another opponent on the scrap heap. Starting to build a tower of himself. Mason, That's how we do it. Victory. What a performance. Ooh, he won some fans, including me. I'll be sticking around for his autograph. I don't do aut autographs, buddy. All right. I think that was pretty good.
<clears throat> okay, those were good missions. We finally made it to level 2 fame. Actually, we got a, like halfway into it with just that one that one arena match. No, we didn't. Okay, it looked like we did, but that was because it was showing the in between the different levels. Um, still not too bad though. So, what do we want to take for salvage? Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Not super fond of any of this. Let's take the cicada part. Let's take Griffin 1S. Uh, 1S. There we go. Take Arch Laser, I guess. Man, this stuff sucks. Uh, should we take more parts, I guess? Crab parts. A crab part. <laughs> there we go. Alright, I'm good with that. 600 damage. 601. To be exact. Light rifle burst fire. Those are tier 3. We get two of those. Then we get one auto cannon, two rapid fire tier 2, and one tier 1 PPCX. And 800k. Yeah. That's not terrible, I guess. The weather's really kicking up, Commander. Your um, visibility will be limited out there. We only took five damage of that. I guess we'll just stick with the Griffin. Why not? Why not, right? It's actually really a good, solid mech for doing these. Uh, yes, allocate. Okay, here we go. Yeah, this Griffin performs well. At least for the arena. Because they're smaller maps. We don't need the speed to get around. And we still have the firepower for the up-close battles. Huh. It's kind of a neat little arena. Oh, this is a duel again. Dang it, I should have taken more money. Alright, well let's try and... We need to do 50 missile damage. And let's try to get salvage from... Why is he already damaged? I think he stepped on something that exploded. That must be it. Um, so yeah, like I was saying, let's try and go for, I guess, either headshot or legs, right? Give us the most salvage parts at the end. What was it, a griffin? No. Uh, trebuchet, that's right. So, legs... I guess because we do need to deal damage too so let's go ahead and get the missile damage done first that was 30 we just need to do one more shot then there we go and one leg down don't know why I switched targets there <laughs> there's nothing else to target alright yep winners that's right Okay. Well, that was easy. I was actually expecting more than a uh, duel. I thought it was going to be another free-for-all. Alright. Pretty good, though. Pretty good. We do get 2.8 mil out of that, which is a nice reward for a really easy mission. Okay. It gave us some, some good stuff here, actually. Uh, which is good, because we had a lot of salvage points. Okay, we can take just about everything, except for a couple of heat sinks. He did a whopping 5 damage to us. So between both arena matches, we have a whopping 11.35 damage that was done to our griffin. Oh no. Whatever will we do? Let's build the cicada. Um, a medium laser. Woohoo. And do we build the griffin? Sure, why not, right? What else are we going to do with it? 
Uh, we had the 1S. This is also a 1S. Okay. Nothing really worth taking out of it. So we'll just throw him in cold storage as well. All right. That's it for our salvage then. Let's go ahead. Which way do we want to go? We got Battlefield over here. That would be a good one to do. We also have that uh, high reward quest. But it's a difficulty 58. So that's pretty tough. Is that a battleground? It sure is. I want to do that. It's only difficulty 24. It's a little bit low. Eh, whatever. We'll do it anyways. Because I like battlegrounds. And then it looked like there were some other good missions over here that we could do. And there's going to be a high value mission. Enemy of my enemy is my friend. All right. Uh, contracts. <clears throat> Glacial ice, 14 square kilometers, ice fog reduced, and it's at night. Uh, reduced visibility. Okay. Uh, this is a battleground. Why do I keep clicking other things? So we want salvage, Mind the and then we'll take money for the rest. Um, I don't particularly feel like I'm going to take a ton of damage here, so that's why I'm not taking... And that's why in most missions I don't take... Uh, the damage insurance stuff, whatever. Because uh, there's a lot of times where that will just be wasted. Make your peace. I'm because I don't take a lot this of damage. Um, who do we want to put you in? You are the ballistic specialist. So Shadowhawk. Yep. Uh, Fiend, you are energy. So for you... Uh, energy missile, that Centurion would actually be a good one for him. Or, Hunchback, Crab, Trebuchet. That might not be a bad idea. Uh, who do we use for our last guy that, oh yeah, the Centurion. Okay, let's do that. Yeah, that one. All right. So are we sticking with the griffin? I didn't think about that. Actually, I'm not sure I want to. Um, You know what? Actually, I want the Shadowhawk. So let's put... Yeah, he can take the Wolverine. That, that'll work good. Okay. I hope. Well, let's see how the AI pilot does with the Wolverine. Alright, ready to go. This should be good. Should be an easy battleground mission. So I guess we'll see. Allies have low morale. Employer units have lowered stats. Oh, goody. Friendly base has defense turrets, though. So that's helpful if we stick near the base. Reactor online. Sensors online. Weapons online. Let's do this. I'm on my way. Sit tight. Our assigned mech target is on the uh, field. Yeah, we're gonna go this way. Down. Eagles nest. Mark units are in engagement range. Closing. Yes, we are. Say hello to Enemy my little friend. Enemy component destroyed. Cicada is about to go down. I guess we can uh, finish it from here. I forgot we have long-range weapons again. Oh yeah, I like having range again. Uh, can we hit whoever's over here? There he is, yep. That was easy. Alright, we got a high value target. Uh, one million sea bills awarded if we kill him in two and a half minutes, roughly. Where is he? Oh, yeah, I think we can get there in two and a half minutes. Actually, our since he's going to our base, the turrets might take care of him for us. Yeah, he's taking damage. I don't think we need to hurry so much. All right, let's pick this up real quick. Uh-huh. Where are you guys going? Oh, hello. 
Is that it over here? I think that was it for the enemies over here. We should be able to hit that guy from here if I can aim properly. Quit destroying my turrets, dude. Oh, I guess I can target him. Not sh I accidentally fired those SRMs. I think I mentioned before, but my thumb just kind of rests right on that button. And so occasionally I will accidentally fire SRMs. Not a big deal. Okay, what's, what's left? Alright, behind us. Shadowhawk 2H. It's got an AC5 burst fire on him. Let's get this guy. Okay, zoomed in a little too close there. Uh, it's habit to zoom in every time I'm on an enemy. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, let's go pick that up. Uh, what did we get from the first one? AC 10, tier 1 though. So nothing special. Okay, we'll pick this up. See what I said though about the damage? We've Brilliant. hardly taken any damage so far as a lance. And if we really needed to, if we did have somebody that took a lot, we can go repair. So there's really not a lot of point to taking the uh, damage insurance on these missions, typically. Unless you're just punching way above your weight class, in which case you might need it. New target Vulcan. Uh, yeah, let's get this guy over here first. Oh, it's an Irby. Hello, Irby. Goodbye, Irby. I'm fiend. Weren't expecting that, huh? Expecting what? For him to blow up? That's exactly what I expected. Why would I expect any less? Okay, I'm having a hard time hitting this guy. There we go. Finally. Uh, what do we got up there? Mm, there was an enemy, so the remaining enemies are kind of spread out here. I think there was one down here. I guess we'll go ahead and get that one while we're down here. Then we had a vehicle that was kind of up there towards the middle of the map, I believe. And then one more mech that's way up there in the top corner, I believe. Oh, never mind. I guess they got him. So it's just the vehicle in the middle and this guy right Excellent in front point, of us. Commander. Beginning recovery now. Seriously? We almost had him. Jump jet fuel low. Jump jet fuel empty. Oh, come on. Just die already, dude. There we go. I really like this Shadowhawk. Uh, and since we upgraded the rapid fire AC2s up to tier 3s instead of tier 2s, he's even better. If we could just get some tier 4s or tier 5s to throw in there, he'd be a real beast. I like the rapid fire 2s. Those are a lot of fun to play with. Uh, the 5s, I need to try out a build at some point we need to build something that has two rapid fire ac5s on it because they have more of that burst fire mode um i want to see how that feels with multiples 4.1 that's a nice payout ac10 was tier one yeah machine gun tier two medium laser short burst tier two so i guess we'll take the engine core right and do, 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 do. what else I'm not sure we really want any of these other mech parts so maybe we just take the burst fire yeah that's kind of unfortunate um, 
And the point of doing battlegrounds is to get a lot of mech salvage, but most of this mech salvage just isn't really worthwhile, unfortunately. Uh, we could probably, I don't know, maybe take something, just something that's easy to build later. Spider. Sure, why not? 800, 200, 100, 200. Took almost no damage, though. I mean, even one point of the damage insurance would have been wasted, because it would have been way more than this. We got, we got way more money than that. Uh, from each point. Negotiation point, that is. So, repair all. Now, where do we want to go next? Oh yeah, we probably want to do those. Holy crap! Difficulty 70? No, we probably don't want to do that. Um, assassination, Scorched Earth, those are low level. 37 Stronghold Defense. That wouldn't be terrible. Beachhead. Demolition and Objective Raid. There's a Ground War, Patrol, Beachhead Defense. Beachhead Defense is pretty good. It's a difficulty 32, so... I guess probably a little lower than I would like, but that's not bad. I prefer something in the 40s, but 30s is... Just good enough. Stuff we got. Um, yeah, let's go do the, the beachhead defense. I think that'll be a good mission for us to finish off with today. And then maybe next time we'll go do that stronghold defense. Okay. Uh, beachhead defense for independence. Good. We need to get our standing up with them some more. Xeno Lycan, 16 square kilometers in the evening with excellent visibility. Okay, should be easy enough. Extra 100% on ourselves. Wow, look at that, 114 salvage points. We better get some good stuff from this. That's all I have to say. Um, oh, I forgot to see how the Wolverine did compared to the others. Uh, let me think. I think he did like 200 or something, right? It, it was pretty close to the others I, from what I remember. I think we had like 200, 100, and 300, or maybe another 200. Maybe it was 212, something like that. I don't remember exactly. Details are not always my specialty. I'm more of a big picture kind of, kind of person. Uh, let's go ahead and roll with that then. Yeah, we'll keep the same team. I think this will be a good team for doing uh, beachhead defense. We got some good good range. Uh, and then some good uh, close range support. Uh, if I could talk correctly, we got some good close range support as well. Okay. One of our assigned targets is flying in. You don't say. Considering we just have to destroy VTOLs, I guess every target that flies in would be on our target list. Uh-huh. Let's rock and roll, boys. I wonder if I need to conserve ammo for a mission like this. These beachhead defense missions can, uh, can take a little bit of time and really burn through your ammo in uh, some cases. Okay, well, we're going to say screw sat relay number two, because that's way up there and I'm not going over there. So we're going to try and stay somewhere around here, I think, in between the main base and sat relay one. Well, I don't know, actually, because that might be tough to defend sat relay one from over here. You got all these big rocks in the way, cliffs or whatever. So I guess we could go up on top of there, though, right? We do have jump jets. Oh, come on. Seriously? Okay, fine. We're going to walk around this way, boys. Since my jump jets were super weak. Yeah, this should give us a decent uh, overlook. Look at that. We can see them from here. 
What's the range on these AC2s anyways? They go up to 1600. So that's probably like just beyond our range, huh? Ha! I hit him. Nice. That VTOL is on our list of targets. Let's make our quarter. Uh, let's situate our guys out here in no problem, front, sir. actually. Target acquired. And I'm gonna move over here somewhere. Jump jet fuel low. Jump jet fuel empty. Taking leg damage. New target quick draw. How you know I'm pro. All right, let's take him. Yeah, probably just using a lot of ammo doing this, huh? Target destroyed. I should try to conserve ammo, honestly. What did we start with? Like 1600 or so? Right on cue. VTOL on approach. Link here. Yes. Target destroyed. Eh. Okay, take him down, guys. Yeah, I don't care about a second satellite relay, you stupid computer. Base defense system. Okay. Felt like that took a lot of ammo. Uh, whoa. Hello, Beatles. Okay, guys, we got... We got stuff to take out over here. It is? Uh, okay. So much for conserving ammo here. I mean, I'm trying a little bit. A little bit. I swear I'm trying, guys. I'm trying not to just burn through my ammo. Oops. <laughs> Once again, hitting the SRMs when I don't mean to. It's okay. A few extra missiles never hurt anything, right? It's not like we're going to run out of ammo for those. All right. So that takes care of that. Now, is our base still being captured? Crap. 24% already. I think that was from the Beatles, though, right? Let's wait and see. Yeah, no, it's not showing anything else over there, so I think we're okay. There we go. You guys get that scorpion. Yeah, there's nothing at the base. So I'm not going to worry about that. Get out of my way, man. Seriously, why are you standing right there? Commander, <laughs> the opposing you? force is sending new units into the battle from the surrounding area. I advise uh, you to uh -huh. secure. Where are they? Looks like they're all over there. They are literally making this a beachhead. Coming from the water. Maybe we want to get a little closer. I don't know, we're kind of right in the middle of the map. I think this is a pretty good spot. We just gotta wait for them to get closer to us. Heh <laughs> Don't miss. Gotcha. Oh. New target, Vulcan. Okay, hey, go get him, guys. Do I really need to give you the command? I'm pretty sure you have eyes can see for yourself. I'm just wasting ammo like that. What do we have for ammo now? 19? We've used up almost half of our ammo already. Okay, where's everybody else at? They're still way out there, huh? What are they fighting against over there? I mean, they already destroyed the sat relay that was out there. I don't see any friendly units out there, so... I don't know, they're just destroying buildings and stuff? 
It looks like they're fighting each other. I have no idea what's going on. Maybe we do need to go out there. This is gonna take forever otherwise. Let's go. Yep, we're gonna go engage, boys. Let's roll. New target target acquired. Yeah. I think this is gonna be it, right? It might be uh, the last wave of enemies coming at us here. Looks like our artillery was fine all along. They never even came in over there. Eh, didn't mean to fire those SRMs again. I guess I should find somewhere else to rest my thumb at. What are they shooting at? I'm confused, man. I don't know what they're all firing at here. They're just destroying, but all the buildings are destroyed. There's literally nothing else to destroy. Kind of looks like they're just fighting each other at this point. Finally. Holy crap, I've never seen a carrier take so long to destroy. Uh, let's, yeah, let's wrap around this way, I guess. I don't know. These guys are just, like, not fighting anything. Who wants some of this? This is Lynx. That takes care of him. Yeah, artillery. Lynx here. Enemy mech destroyed. Okay, let's focus our fire here, guys. Oops, sorry, Centurion. Okay, he's down. Is that another wave of enemies that just spawned in? I think it was. Either that or it was these guys that kind of looped around. No, they look fresh. Okay, guys, get that goblin. I gotta start heading this way to cut them off, or they're gonna get to that sap relay. Why does 64 kph feel so slow? I mean, I guess it is pretty slow, but... Yeah, okay, I was wrong. That was not the last wave. Okay, go get him, boys. If you're faster than me, don't wait up. Jump jet fuel low. Jump jet fuel empty. Incoming missile. Uh, I gotta get that other guy's attention. This is going right where it hurts. There we go. And now the ammo's getting low. That's okay. I think we're getting close to being done with this mission. I know these are long missions, but it seems like we got to be close to being done, right? I know there's another guy over there, but I think that's it. Uh, let's start moving. Oh, nope. We got more of them. Okay, then. Let's, yeah, let's get this guy over here first. Attacking from here. Hunchback. Wow. A lance is kind of spread out here, aren't they? It's not really what I had in mind. Uh, Centurion. Yes, sir. You just fall in on me. I don't know what you're doing over there. Where's that hunchback go? There he is. He's not even doing anything. Just chilling. See, I think we'll get these guys over here first. Order acknowledged. 
I guess I should hold on my ammo. We're just about out. Yeah, he's looking at me. Okay, where'd the other guy go that was right up here? There he is. Crab. I'm gonna try just focusing on using SRMs mainly at this point to help us conserve some ammo. If somebody's focused on me and doing damage, I'll use my AC2s. Well, this Phoenix Hawk is on me. Okay. Uh-huh. Okay, focus down the Centurion, guys. No problem, sir. What are they doing? Why are they all way over there? Guys, you're not helping by being way over there. At least I got some other friends here. And there goes all my AC2 ammo. Seriously, what are they doing? I think I need to go back over towards our lance so I can switch mechs. I'm trying to protect my left side here. I don't want the left arm to fall off. Oh, they got enemies on them too. Okay, you guys take care of the enemies that are near you. Um, you know what? Let's go ahead and switch. Not you. Yeah, that works. New target, hunchback. Uh, what are we doing over here, guys? Okay, go down. Oh no. Okay, finally. Another hunchback. Man, these hunchbacks are beastly. There's a lot of them. Did we get cockpit there? Doesn't seem like it. That was all side force, it wasn't it? Alright, what's left? Where's my Shadowhawk? He's still over there. Can you come this way, please? Actually, over there might be the safer spot. It doesn't matter. This guy's dead, and I think we're done. No? Yes. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, that was fun. That was a long mission, huh? Yeah, beachhead defenses. Sometimes that happens. Um, I'm not sure if there's, like, a set number of waves that they send out at you, or... Or what? Yeah, I wonder. I don't know. Should be some good salvage from that, though, right? I mean, we've got tons of salvage points, so I really hope so. We could do a quick draw. Well, no, we could only get four parts. Probably we'll do that anyways, though. Griffin Dervish. Dervish is a decent 55 tonner. Good missile mech. We'll take those parts. Mm, we could build that crab. Good hunchback. Lots of different hunchbacks. Centurion, AL. Don't care much about that. I guess let's load up on some weapons here, because what else are we going to do? I'll take the prototype PPC, I guess. If nothing else, we can at least use it to compare. So we can actually see what it does, what the difference between a prototype PPC and a regular PPC is. Um, nothing else here really, so let's, I guess we're going to take a bunch of mech parts here. Uh-huh. 
champion. Do I want the champion parts? It's not one of my favorites. <laughs> I probably won't even use it, but we got so many points, might as well take the parts, huh? Uh, crab. I guess we're going to finish building the crab. Well, not finish it, but we'll we'll add some more parts to that. And then we got seven more, so we'll just take top seven, I guess. Works for me. All right, guys. 2,300, 200, 200, and 300. So, yeah, the Wolverine holds his own. Kind of right in there, in the mix with the rest of them. That Centurion is still a beast. That is hard to beat. It's actually surprising. I did not think it would be that good. I wonder why it is that good. Very interesting. Um, anyways, we pumped out the damage on that one, though, for sure. We got our kill three crabs. Gives us tier two medium rifle times two, so two of them. Uh, 1.2 million C bills. Yeah, let's go ahead and claim that. Enhanced energy output. Nice. Okay, we do need to repair all. Yeah, that Shadowhawk took some damage, man. Jeez, they lit him up. Luckily, it's all just armor damage and a little bit of structure. But, um, yeah, that was something. So, that handles that. I think uh, that's going to do it for today's episode. Next time, I think what we'll do is probably do this patrol. Maybe even the ground war as well. And then, I think we might try the Stronghold Defense Contract. Um, those are long missions, but they can be rewarding, and they're fun. So I think we'll probably end up doing that, and then we can also eventually do the assassination, the assassination and Scorched Earth contracts over there. Um, so that should give us plenty to get up to for the next episode. Anyways, thanks for following along, guys. I hope you're enjoying it, and I'll see you next time.